Yes, actually, no. <laughs> yes, it was me. And then she makes them close their eyes, but we didn't do that for you. <laughs> well, right? Full disclosure, pre-K, we did do the guest this morning yes. before you came. Because, oh. as you can see, part yes. of our morning message was that we had a mystery meeting. Yes. So I did give them some clues this morning, and Hannah guessed that it was you. Because we've been talking about your vision. Hannah, yes. yes. So. You look very comfortable in your rock. I've been staying until 3 o'clock. The two bucks are right behind you. So these are the two bucks that we've collected. They're on inside. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So pre-K, should we do our poem before Archbishop Blair does his reading? Oh, yes. I would love to. Yes. Okay. So, um, kindergarten, first and second, you can just follow along, okay? In pre-K, I want to hear you nice and loud, because we've been doing this for a while. Ready? Okay. Two hands high, two hands low, two hands pat, pat, pat. Two hands circle round and round, two hands make a hat. Two hands wiggle, two hands shake, two hands clap, clap, clap. Two hands roll up in a ball. Two hands take a nap on our lap. All right. And that shows that we are ready to listen. Okay. All for you. I'm going to make the priest do that. <laughs> <laughs> that is great. <clears throat> All right. Now, come on. You're on. <clears throat> <back. laughs> this starts off with a question <clears throat> Can you say peace? A question mark. By Karen Katz. Today is Peace Day all around the world. Children everywhere will wish for peace, hope for peace, and ask for peace. All around the world today, there will be many different ways to say peace. See all the different kids from all around the world on the side of the book? <clears throat> Mina lives in India. Mina says, Shanti. That's how you say peace in India. Shanti. Shanti. Emily lives in America. Emily says, peace. That you all know, right? <laughs> you want to say it with me? Peace. Peace. Kenji lives in Japan. She, Kenji says, Heiwa. 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 Lynette lives in Australia. Lynette says, Kortuku. Kortuku. Carlos lives in Mexico. Carlos says, Paz. Hannah lives in Iran. Hannah says, Seoul. Stefan lives in Russia. Stefan says, Mir. China. May says, Hey Ping. Hey Ping. You're learning a lot of ways to say peace. Claire lives in France. Claire says, Pay. Pay. Almost the same as peace. Siddiqui lives in Ghana. Siddiqui says, Gum Gigi. <laughs> That's a nice language, Gum Gigi. <laughs> you like Gum 
and Gigi. <laughs> <laughs> Alona lives in Bolivia. Well, this is a hard one. Alona says, Moksha Kama Mia. I'm not going to try to say that twice. <laughs> <laughs> All around the world, children want to go to school, to walk in their towns and cities, to play outside, and to share food with their families. They want to do all these things and feel safe. No matter how we say it, we all want peace. Now, would I be correct in saying that all of us in this room want those good things and we want to live in peace? Yes. Well, let's hear it for peace then. Let's say it together. Peace. 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 See, all the different kids from everywhere saying it in their own languages. Well, there you have it. I've run out of pages. Thank you very much. Well, you're most welcome.